Hello, this is Bob Mara 501, and I'm going to be showing you how to watch memories and, and edit them in Super Mario 64. So first you have this program called MHS, or Memory Hacking Software. So now we're going to start up a new watch, which we'll call Mario's Speed or something. And the address you want to enter would be 00C26C44. And we'll leave it as a float type, because, yeah, it's fun. Anyway, now that we have that, we want to open the program, Muppin, as I like to call it. Now that that's open, we want to go back to MHS and go to Open Process. And choose... Mupin 64 you're recording or nothing, I don't care. And once you've done that, if you load a safe state or whatever and you start moving, uh, the value will start changing spasmatically. Okay, so now let's see what happens if you were to try to, to actually TAS while doing that. So let's, um, where's that thing I started? Okay, here. Anyway, so let's see what speeds I can get. What's the next list? Okay, so. As you can see, my house speed will reach about 50, 51, 52. That should be, that's a good amount for diving. I can avoid that sign. Okay. Now I just keep on diving. I'm going up to like 50 again. And yeah, you just can watch the speed and edit it if need be. Okay, and now let's watch my speed if you were to enter a backwards long jump. Okay, so um. Okay, so you start up a backwards long jump. Watch Mario's speed. This, this is important. It's negative because Mario is moving backwards. Each BLJ you do adds a decent amount of speed and it just keeps on going up. And as you can see, I reached about 800 and something speed, which is a pretty good amount. And 400 is all you really need to do that really miming effect. Now for editing speeds, um, let's just do a jump or something, check the, okay that was fail, do a jump or something, and now if you enter a positive speed, you double click and then you just can change the value, if you enter a positive speed, um, it'll make Mario go flying forwards, as such. And if you enter a negative speed, it will make Mario basically go into the backwards only jump state. Yeah. That's what
basically how you do memory edit and whatnot and watch. Let's do another one just for the heck of it. As you can see it just makes Mario go flying off. Like anywhere, you don't even need a backwards long jump really. It's a great way to test stuff. Okay, yeah, and that's basically how you memory edit memory watch. Okay, hopefully this helps 